Shout out to Supersonic X because I'm trying to get him to 1k subscribers. So anyway, let's start the video. and dick songs ran to why don't i like reading by jada animation if i want to know why i'm late on reacts to this well i was working on a um a um mv um video because you know i had like i had 2800 subscribers like about two weeks ago or a week ago i'm not even real sure and you know i'm almost at um 2900 subscribers now so i was you know working on uh an M A A M V for for you know two two thousand eight hundred so thank you for that and Jaden anime Jaden animation uploaded like an hour ago so you know so I'm gonna stop working on that and watch this so yeah so nothing to about Instagram and Spotify for any real kind of don't forget to check out the original video before you watch out the reaction don't forget to subscribe to Jay Animation because you make good animations in my opinion so yeah let's get to the video these one way and cheese reading books. Oh, oops. Libraries. It's all, it's all boring. boring. I don't know if that's an unpopular opinion or not. But when I was growing up, it was pretty normal. But now I always hear people gush about how great it is to bundle up in a warm okay, guys. blanket with, quote, a good book. While the faint light of the fall I'm agree doing Jaden. out of their cracked windows and hits their collection guys, of I'm a fine reader. Perfectly. They've got a warm cup of like, chamomile Like, if someone tells me to read, I'll read. Like, if I have to read for school, I'll read. Story. But, like, they were about to get one at I don't Target like reading. Because they were on sale. But they received one as a gift instead. I just do it because I want to have, I want to talk <laughs> normal. Because everyone always says, which one was the vocabulary. going on over there. But I still don't like reading and have a cat allergy. It's kind of complicated. The thought of reading sounds really nice to me. It's supposed to be calming and good for your brain in some sort of way. Mm. I don't know how exactly, but people repeat it all the time, so it might be true. But I think I've got some weird reading PTSD from school because the other part of my brain thinks about how boring and slow and too quiet it's going to be. And I feel like I have to take notes and memorize things and identify the plot points and know the names and symbolisms and To Kill a Mockingbird. And oh god, okay. I'm supposed to read now if you have to read by Thursday or through it. I used to love reading. I still have the strong memory of going to my elementary school's library and being excited to check out the next Geronimo Stilton book because I love the pictures and fun text they had. They always wrote the word cheese. This is like their this. part about reading. Read like some people don't like to read, but like some of the, some people actually just I found a book read I only to up, look at the pictures. That's why some people like picture books. I was able to crush a 300 pager in two days, which I don't think is considered impressive anymore but it was in fifth grade and look that was the only self-worth i had all right but when school started making well, guys i'm not a fast force but guys i'm actually a normal reader I'm, I'm not a fast like reader but i'm not a slow reader time. especially if you're gonna so make me read, read for you i'll read for you in the 1940s that i need cliff notes to decode just to realize that all the animals were communists also, it's twenty percent of my grade. I, I get it though. What else are That's we gonna do? That's the thing about school. English like easy, easy. Okay, other, for me, right? I have to read every English. week. I, that's got to count for something, right? Some the more I had to read really animal. cryptic books in my spare and time, where the symbolism like, is in the color week, of the main character's curtains. I had to do some project about it. And I'm not even observant yeah. enough to realize they had curtains. Led me to not really in having fun. <laughs> <laughs> and also feeling like an idiot. I like my subtlety like I like my coffee. Uh, splash in my face. No, I'm not supposed finished. to know what the A stands for adultery. I don't know. I, it could mean a woman for all I know. Asparagus. But all that isn't anything new. Everyone complains about English assignments. Hey, yes, Everyone was hates my, reading the that was my mom. letter. Everyone thinks school should die. However, something that also locked in my disdain for reading was Yeah, my but guys, mom. here's the thing for me. Hi, I don't think school course, should die. As a parent, you and don't I have a reason why. Do nothing but play video games all day. That obviously leads to undeniable life failure. So what's the solution? make them read more and on paper i don't think there's anything wrong with that honestly i'll probably use that parenting technique too when applicable i think my mom made the obvious good parenting decision but as the victim here i believe i fell in the small minority where it had the overall opposite effect Does, during summer like vacation reading. my mom would always tell me that i needed to read at least two books so i don't forget how to read whenever my mom would walk in on my brother and i playing mario kart together in the living room she would ask if mm. we read yet today which we would respond no because readings for chumps 
and then she'd lock us in our rooms to be chumps. I started hating reading so much, I would rather do literally nothing than read a book. There were a I was about to say, then just lie and say you actually did read a book. Books because I just didn't I'm just kidding, don't be a lie, don't be a lie. I'm just kidding, I'm just joking. There dragons, I think, called The Secret Country, and I still remember <laughs> that just looking at the cover would put me in a bad mood because of hatred association. Grow your secret country. When I was being forced to read, I would sit angrily on my bed, open the book, move the bookmark a reasonable amount forward to make it look like I read, and then just sit there for okay. 30 minutes staring at it. It was boring, and I don't know what was wrong with me. I could have had at least a decent time if I just tried to read the dang book, but I guess it turned into a dignity thing. Actually, the I like part that poster maybe right a year there. Or so later, I decided to restart the same book and give it another shot on my own terms. And I finished it in two days. It was pretty good. I did it again mm. with another book called Molly, Molly Moon, Moon and the Morphing Mystery. It's like the fifth book N in this Molly Moon series. Uh, it's been a while, so I don't really remember the story, but it's about this Never orphan who can hypnotize people and has a pug. Anyway, it's funky oh, because so she has I actually powers. read the okay. first few books of the series on my own and remember really liking them. I would read them any chance I got, but as soon as I was forced to read this one, I just decided I'd rather literally waste my time and sit alone rebelling against reasonable parenting. But this time I never went back to read it. I I think that might have been the point of no return for me. I think the association no of reading as a necessity or shit. some sort of punishment has deluded itself in me. And now I just feel like reading isn't fun or I'm in trouble for something even though I live alone. I've tried listening to audiobooks, but honestly, they make me feel really lonely. I don't know why. It might be the lack I don't, of I, don't read. I like pictures. Also, no one else is I don't read those. It's the same with music. Uh, I've never been a big music person, so whenever I try to sit down and do something while listening to music, it somehow enhances this feeling of being Guys, alone. Guys, I'm actually not a music person too. That's why slower, when someone says, "Do you want to listen to some popular so music?" I'm like, YouTube videos "Sure." Because streams in the background. I'm still of course, not I'm not gonna say to Twitch yet, but I like no. Ryu Kara's stuff. He plays Mario Maker. Sometimes I wish I read more. It doesn't it love might be Twitch. Good for me to slow down I'm not really a music person. That's why whenever there's a new popular me a song, hand, I'm, 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 I'm of course I'm not gonna know until a few months later. If you like reading, I think that's really great. I've got a lot of friends who like reading, and it's cool that you've got a really nice hobby you can fall back on to de-stress or however you people feel while staring at words all day. I was gonna say you should recommend a good book I should give a try, but I took mm -hmm. a second to think about if I would actually try to read any suggestions, and being real with myself, the answer is no. Nope. <laughs> so, nope. uh, enjoy that chamomile tea. Hey, hey, how's everyone doing? At home, I suppose. I'm lucky that I work yeah, from because, home you know. the house, so quarantine isn't hitting me too hard. But to those of you who are outside people needing suggestions, may I suggest watching all of my videos in an infinite loop until we can leave our houses? Ooh. I actually recommend that one more. Any mutuals who are playing, send me your friend code. Ooh, I maybe we should watch Jada Animations or old videos. So what I'll do you guys think? And see how many people online are playing Animal Crossing. Normally it's a hundred percent. Anyway, however you're keeping yourself busy during quarantine, I hope you're doing well and thanks for watching my video. Bye. Okay, so guys, okay, so two things. One, not a real fan of Animal Crossing. No offense to Animal Crossing, I just that I never saw it as fun. So, but guys, tell me in the comments, is Animal Crossing a good franchise and should I play it? Cause I only played one game of it. You know, to me, it was just average. So boring. Second thing, um, about people wanted to um school to die. Well, see, only reason I like school is actually only because I know my friends are going to be there. If y'all don't know, I live somewhere far away where I have to walk, take the train, then walk again. Then when I'm going, when I'm going back to home. I have to walk, take the train, walk again. So. Because when I was in elementary school, it wasn't, like, really hard. Because, you know, I actually did saw some of my friends. And then when I had middle school, my, my friends moved. Which, I only see, like, two of my friends now, which, at that. And I do have some friends at school, but, like, they live in different places. Like, I, I, live, I live in Brooklyn. They live in Manhattan. Because I go to school in Manhattan. That's why I need to take a train. See what I'm talking about? 
if you live in New York or Brooklyn, you're not gonna know what I'm talking about. Um, so yeah, so, so guys, like, I hate reading, but I was, I still read because sometimes I have nothing else to do. Like, sometimes, because sometimes when I get bored playing video games, I have nothing else to do. Like, the only other thing I do is, the two things I mostly do is make videos, play video games, and just eat. Sometimes I do, I'll, I'll try, try to do something else, like do push-ups or something. But other than that, like, yeah. But yeah, guys, so yeah, that's it. Who you guys are. Peace, bye. I'm uploading my content. Shout out to watch Jada Animations. Shout out to watch Jada Animations' old videos. Because, why not? I'll watch their, I'll watch her old videos. Why not? So guys, please tell me in the comments. Shout out to watch Jada Animations' old videos. So yes, that's it. Who gives you a please subscribe, upload a new video, comment, so yes, that's it. I'll see you guys. Goodbye, peace.